Welcome back guys, Lone Star Patriot here. Thanks for joining me. So the Air Precision Build Series rifle is now complete. And so what I wanna do next is perform some accuracy testing on the barrel that I installed. Now as a reminder, I installed the Ballistic Advantage, their 16 inch Hanson Profile Performance Series barrel. It does have a one in seven twist rate. So what I wanna do at the range is run a variety of loads through this barrel, both in terms of grain weight, as well as price point to determine which specific load suits this barrel the best. So let's head over to the range and we'll get started with the testing.
right guys, so right up to the video covering the actual testing on the Ballistic Advantage barrel that I installed a part of the Air Precision Build Series rifle. Now before we jump into the results that you just saw from the clips that I rolled in, let's first talk about the setup of the rifle for the testing at the range and also the weather conditions during the testing. So in terms of the setup of the rifle, so I was using a bipod off the front of the rifle to help support and stabilize the rifle well. And then also for the glass, I was using a primary arms, it's their one to eight Gen 3 second focal plane scope. So overall, pretty good glass. Now in terms of the weather conditions, so overall the conditions were pretty much ideal. It's about 50 degrees Fahrenheit, but clear skies, sunny skies, and also essentially no wind. So basically ideal conditions. Now moving on to the test results. So again, as I mentioned earlier in the video, this specific barrel has a one in seven twist rate. So I chose grain weights that range from 55 grain on the low end all the way up to 77 grain on the high end, given that that one in seven twist rate can stabilize heavier grain bullets very well. Now, in terms of the results that you saw, so the winner for this specific barrel was the IMI Systems. It's our 556, 69 grain load. It's a Sierra Match King hollow point boat tail load, but the overall group was about one and a quarter inches. So overall, very good results. Now for the other loads, everything else fared pretty well. The groups ranged from anywhere from about two to three and a half inches roughly. But overall, the barrel performed well. And again, this 69 grain load appears to be the clear winner. Now, just because this specific load works well in my barrel, for example, doesn't mean that it also worked well in your barrel. So I'd encourage you that if you have this barrel, you go out and perform your own testing to determine which specific load suits you the best. But overall, hopefully you found the video helpful. Hopefully you enjoyed the Air Precision Build series. But thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. And keep up the good fight. The 16 inch ballistic advantage, handsome profile. So, again, pretty much ideal. I was using a bipod off the front of the rival. Rival? Rival? Before we jump into the results, let me remind you again that it is with.